Ladies and gentlemen, it is your host here. That is right. It is Team Rai Rai. Anywho, how is everyone doing on this Saturday's edition? I am doing wonderful. Now, everyone out there, I have social media accounts. But don't worry, I'll discuss that later on in the video. Thank you very much for understanding. Now, I want you guys and gals to sit back, relax, put your feet up, grab some meat, or grab some to drink. Or maybe, just maybe, you want to chill like a villain. And hear my thoughts, my opinions on this subject. And of course, the link will be down below, or the article will be down below. It will be strictly an article. Okay, now everyone is aware by now, I'm looking at my laptop, I don't want to mess up, that Clash at the Castle is coming up very soon, June 15th. So this is amazing news, right? Now, tickets went on sale not too long ago. Now listen to this. According to some information, I'm going to say this, on BBC Report, UK fans have experienced concern over the cost of tickets for the upcoming W. Clash of Castle pay per view and it will kick off June 15th. Now I'm looking at these prices, these are ridiculous prices, and it's not even mania. Come on, Debbie, do better. UK fans, if you're out there, please let me know if you bought tickets for this event or did you pass this up the opportunity and said. Save your money for other things. Maybe you want to go to Mania next year in Las Vegas. Maybe you're going to go to Money at Bank this summer or SummerSlam in Cleveland, Ohio. I'm just wondering, UK fans. This is just for all UK fans out there. So I think these prices are just very, very high. That's WWE for you. You know, I was wondering how much it costs for the nosebleeds. Probably still expensive. That's insane. When did they start making these very high prices? Is it ever since uh, the new management, TKO, took over? This is just unreal. Now, if you have, like, kids, grandkids, and then you want to take them to the event, are you going to disappoint them or not? It sucks, you know? Yes, I know everything goes up in price, but still. Now, I have not been to any wrestling kind of event in a very long time. You know? It seems like the price is going up every year. And, of course, some people could afford it. Other people says, I am not going to even touch it these prices this is off my book list i i've been to these kind of events before but not in the uk you know now another thing is if you have decided you know american people like myself decided to go to the uk you buy gotta buy tickets for this event when it went on sale you gotta book an airline ticket and of course you gotta book a, a hotel or maybe you have friends you can stay with. <clears throat> it's up to you, you know, to save some money. And also, you're not going to go empty-handed empty -handed at this event. That means you're going to buy merchandise and food. And that is not cheap either. You know, when you go to these events, for WWE, they always have exclusives. You know? Say, so I was there or something like that. You know, I've been there, you know, back of your shirt, you know. 
they don't do that on the shop because it's at the event. You know what I'm saying? It makes sense. So a lot of you out there who is going to this event will pick up merchandise, you know? And most of them shirts are very, very pricey. They are. I can't imagine how much of them titles, replica, probably three times as much than the website. I don't know how they are, but you could buy it there. And then if you live in UK, that's fine. Just leave in your vehicle. Well, take it with your vehicle. But if you're from America, want to visit a lot of history, you got to ship that belt back with you. And that is a pain in the butt. I never did it before, you know? I usually just buy this stuff out there. And, um, you know, some people like to bring their belts to the events. That, that's fine and dandy. Hopefully, W does not say, you know what? No more belts. You know, that sucks. You know? Hopefully, it does not happen. You know? So, let me know what you think to all the UK fans out there. Please respond whenever you can, if you want to respond to this. I think these pet prices are very, very, very high. I agree with all the UK fans out there. Okay? Of course, it's too late that we could do anything about it because when they announced it, the tickets went on sale and then it's unreal. And I cannot imagine how much it costs for a summer flame this August. Probably very expensive too, but it's summer flame for crying loud. Anyway, I'm going to wrap this up here. Follow me on Instagram, Twitch, Twitter, TikTok. All my social media accounts will be down below. Now, if you want to be part of the Rara Show, that's fine. Again, if not, don't worry about it. See you guys tonight. Deuces.